Hi, today I'm going to be telling a Cherokee legend. This is one of the few stories from our people that I've memorized just because when I was younger my grandpa always used to tell me this story and it was one of my favorites. And it's called The Little Boy and the Rattlesnake. Well, the story begins, it was a cold day, much like this one, and a little boy, probably about 10 years old, was walking down a path and he came across a rattlesnake. And he had always been told by his parents, you know, don't play with rattlesnakes, don't play with snakes at all, they're dangerous, they can kill you. Well, the rattlesnake looked up at the boy and said, I'm cold, I'm old, and I'm dying. Will you please take me up the mountain so that I can see the sunset one last time before I die? And the boy thought to himself, I don't know if that's a good idea. So he said, no. I can't take you up the mountain because if I pick you up, you'll definitely bite me. But the rattlesnake said, No, I have no reason to do that. You are my only way to see the sunset one last time. I promise you, if you will take me up the mountain, I will not bite you. So after a few minutes, the boy finally agreed. He picked up the snake and held it close to his chest. And he took him up to the top of the mountain. And they sat and watched the sunset together. And this was just this beautiful, humongous sunset. Well, after the sun had set, the rattlesnake looked to the boy and said, I want to go home now. I'm tired, and I'd like to go to bed. Well, the boy picked up the snake and took him back to his, his house, and, well, the rattlesnake spent the night with the boy, and they slept together, and, you know, they went to, slept, went to sleep. Well, the next morning came, and the rattlesnake looked to the boy and said, this is the day I will die. I know it. So will you please take me to my home? I want to die where I was born. So the boy decided to pick up the snake and took him back to where he had found him the day before. So, he, they got there, and the boy put the snake down. And as soon as the boy put the snake down, it turned around and bit him. And the boy, you know, freaked out a little bit. Why did you do that? rattlesnake. Now I will surely die. You promised me you would not bite me. And the snake looked to the boy and said, you're a fool because you knew what I was when you picked me up. And that's the end of the story. Now I've always believed that there's a moral in every story or legend that the Native Americans have told. And I believe that the moral of this story was that, you know, be careful who you trust. If a person is known for breaking trust, I wouldn't trust them personally. <laughs> well, like I said, be careful who you trust. Remember this story because this story has helped me a lot throughout my life. Thank you.